probably my least favorite bit about coming traveling is washing day. Not because of the actual washing up, just because you've got no idea what the machine says. I think everything about doing colors, whites and darks together has gone out the window. The guy whose Airbnb it is said that that will wash and dry your clothes, but I think lost in translation, I think it'll just wash it and leave them in there all day wet. If people think I do a rubbish job of explaining what I'm actually doing that day, I don't disagree with you, but half the time I've actually got no idea what I'm doing myself. Today we're off to Elephant Mountain, we're going to catch a cable car up, watch the sunset, it's like a viewpoint over Taipei where you can see like the whole of the city and you're fairly close to it, and then later on we're going to go out for food with the people we met on the first night. Found the Uber. Windows are always so tinted in these. It always makes my camera look so grainy. I can't even film in them. We've just got to the cable cart place. We've just seen it online. It's just got like good recommendations on the TripAdvisor. So I just thought we'd come check it out. We're gonna go to Elephant Mountain. It's just also a good place to go watch the sunset. We're back out with Nicole and Victor tonight, the people we met on the first night. They were probably the coolest people we've met on the whole trip. They take us out for food again, it's pretty gnarly because last time the food they were ordering was just, I don't know, totally out the uh, out the comfort zone for us, that I guess is a good thing. That stinky tofu and everything and the fully fried fish, a bit gnarly but I'm excited again to see them all. Just you yeah, have another good night out, something out now in about a week, nibble it's been about three days. just got in the cable cart now, it's got four different stops, so you like get off at each stop and check out what's going on there. It is also one of the first carts, first cart so like my professional, I don't know why I called it a cart, like I'm some sort of like cable cart enthusiast. <laughs> it's one of the first cable carts I've seen with a glass floor. It was so much further than I expected as well. It took about half an hour, 40 minutes to get up to the top. We're just having a bit of a walk around. There's just shops and cool viewpoints. And it is 10 to 4 now. We're sort of, it turns a bit of a race against time because we still need to get up Elephant Mountain and then we're meeting for dinner at 7 o'clock. We've been at this cafe. It's got like a nice scenic view. We've got a couple of drinks. It is quarter past four. We still need to get down in the cable car, so it's half an hour, make it to Alfred Mountain, do the hike up to the top, watch the sunset, get back, get changed, with time to still meet Victor and Nicole. What I think is mad, right, is that if I get a coin and chuck it out the window, it's weird that could maybe be found in like 20,000 years by someone, and it'd be like an ancient artifact. So we've been up the cable carts, we're now off to Elephant Mountain. We've got a bit of a hike up, it's about 1.4 kilometers. Are we actually going though? Are we not gonna have time? Pick wants to meet at seven, it's five. We've gotta go back and get back over here at 101 to meet. Change of plan, I think we're just gonna go straight home. We've got two hours to go home, get changed, get ready, and meet Victor. We've got an Uber, back now, we need to go get changed, get showered. I need to do my washing. He's got a punchline. I can see it coming. I know, I know. I, I need to do my washing. I need to do my washing, get changed, get ready, <laughs> and be at 101 for seven o'clock to meet Victor. No punchline. 
You need a punch down though. But on the way- I've had my shower, I dropped my clothes off at the dry cleaners before, and it's like, one of those places where there's no one watching it, and there's loads of people hanging around. If I go down now, and my clothes are still in the dryer, I'm honestly gonna put the lottery on.